Hi, this is Ramesh from Domgenie. In this demo, we will showcase you the capabilities of our AI-powered RAG model. As of today, this model is trained to answer a variety of questions related to card and payment domain. So let's get started. First of all, I will ask a question related to OCT functionalities. So I'm asking a question, can you help me understand how to identify OCT transactions as per VIDA ISO 8583 specification? You can see that it mentions about MTI processing code. It also talks about the business application ID, which is data element 104. And it also return an answer related to MCC. So it has provided almost every single key data element that is required to identify an OCT transactions. So now if you want to know more about the BAI, you can probably you know, ask any other question to deep dive into the respective data elements. Let me ask another question. So I'm asking a question about the matching logic that is used in a clearing uh, transaction processing. Yeah. So it has got a lot of things. It is talking about TCR zero, which is used as a card number, it talks about transaction date and time, acquire ID, um, and uh, RRN, authorization code, merchant ID, and it talks about the unique transaction ID, which is in authorization, it is data element 62.2. So it provides almost all the data elements that can be used by any issuer to basically match a clearing transaction against an authorization. Now I will ask Domgenie about HSM commands and some keys exchange process. Here is the answer. The first step is the key component generation where both the parties generate clear ZFK component using HSM command A0, then both of them, you know, uh, combine the ZMK components and form the final encrypted component. And uh, the party who is sharing the key, they export the keys, the data encryption key under the ZMK and the other party import the same keys under the same ZMK. And this is the key exchange method it talks about we can exchange the keys in the UAT like over the email, whereas in the production, it should be via some secure method. Let me quickly ask uh, one question about one of the HSM command. So I just asked about a command to validate the ARKC, which is the EMV chip data. This is the answer. You have KQ command and KW command. Yes, both the commands are used to validate the ARKC. And it has also given all the input parameters required for these commands. Yeah. This was a quick demo of Dom Genie. We can also conduct the live demo. Kindly reach out to us if you want us to conduct a live demo for you. Thank you so much.